Hi, this is Poker Brit sitting down with Spit Club's very own poker room manager, SC Kenny, here to take some of your most important questions. Mox from Calamante Creek, Texas wanted to know, Mr. Kenny, suppose you have pocket aces on the button in a few hands of a large tournament. All players up to the cutoff have made small raises. Then the cutoff goes all in. Do you call? This is the age old debate. You have the pocket aces, which is the best hand possible, but you're up against multiple players, so your percentage chance goes down. On the other hand, they're now laying you odds, giving you the best hand. What do you do? In the beginning of a tournament, I still call. In the middle of the tournament, I still call. If it's at the end, though, I still call. Several players ask, can you explain the difference between pot odds and implied odds? Pot odds are simply the price you're getting to make the call. If the pot has 500 in it and you need to call 100, you're getting 5 to 1 on your money. Let's say you have pocket threes and there's a raise and a call. You're not getting the right price now to call, but if you know the players are going to pay you off if you hit your hand, it's sometimes worth it to take a little bit the worst of it now to make a big reward on it later. Big Daddy Bunk wanted to know, how would you handle moving to a new table? Would you sit out for a bit and watch the players, or would you play the cards if they were good? After building an image on one table and getting moved to another table, you must start over. You don't know how the table's playing, is it playing fast or slow? You don't know who's on tilt or who's wild. I sit back and watch the table, but you must play premium hands no matter what the situation is. Dinosaur55 from Massachusetts asks, Hi, I'm trying to understand position in poker. They say it's always better to go last, but if someone is in front of you, can't they bluff you first? Yes, the player in front of you has first opportunity to bluff. However, it's not so easy to bluff when you have players behind you and you don't know if they've plopped a big hand or not. You could be getting your chips in very badly or even drawing dead. Thanks to all our members who sent in their questions. If you have any questions for Kenny, please submit them to Ask Kenny on his profile page. If we use your questions here, we'll send you a t-shirt. That's right. This is Poker Brit and SC Kenny wishing you the best on and off the tables.